you connected with Chad, you go yep. in band camp? That's a misconception. So okay. I connected with Chad in beginning band class okay. when we lived in the Kemsville area for a very short term. Um, I lived in the Salem area and we actually were able to attend to the Kemp's Landing District. It was pretty weird how that worked because now that I think about it, we probably should have been going to like Salem Junior, but for whatever reason I met Chad in Kemp's Landing, I mm -hmm. went there. But then we moved from that area and then I didn't see Chad again. And the next time I saw him was when I went to Independence Junior and that's where I met Mr. Edwards, um, my band teacher there, and he, he tapped me to be evaluated by this um, school program that they had for in Virginia Beach, Virginia, called Old Donation, the Center for the Gifted and Talented. Mm -hmm. And there was kind of like a magnet school type setup for kids that were like kind of artistically inclined. Right. And there I went for music and, um, you know, I go in for drums and I, I meet my teacher, Ralph Copley, and then I look over there and I see Chad playing the sax. I'm like, dude. Kim's Landing, beginning band, you're still in it, I'm still in it, that's crazy. Mm -hmm. So then like we would see each other at band, at band camp and then sometimes, you know, I would go to his house to play because he had like Casio keyboards and uh, we would like make little tracks and just for fun, mm -hmm. you know. And then I met Shay, um, who's also in NERD, I met Shay when we, um, sometimes I would bring him over to Chad's house with me when we would make music and we just ended up having like a little band. Right. And that's when we started like entering high school contests because we love the music we were making and we wanted to show people what we were doing. Right. But we didn't think it was going to be like, you know, it's going to end up here doing an interview with you. Like, come on. Like, oh yeah, you know, mid 80s, um, you say to yourself, yeah, you're going to end up doing an interview on CBS when right. you're going to be 41. 